Motorcycle Speedway, usually referred to as Speedway, is a motorcycle sport involving four and sometimes up to six riders competing over four anti-clockwise laps of an oval circuit. Speedway motorcycles use only one gear and have no brakes. Racing takes place on a flat oval track usually consisting of dirt, loosely packed shale, or dolomite. Competitors use this surface to slide their machine sideways, power sliding or broadsiding into the bends. On the straight sections of the track the motorcycles reach speeds of up 70 miles per hour. The exact origins of the sport are unknown but there is evidence of a type of speedway racing being practiced in the USA before the First World War and in Australia in the late 1910s and early 1920s. There are now both domestic and international competitions in a number of countries including the Speedway World Cup whilst the highest overall scoring individual in the Speedway Grand Prix events is pronounced the world champion. Speedway is popular in Central and Northern Europe and to a lesser extent in Australia and North America. A variant of track racing, Speedway is administered internationally by the FAR Copyright DAO Copyright Ration International de Motocyclism. Domestic Speedway events are regulated by FIM-affiliated National Motorsport Federations. History The early history of Speedway race meetings is a subject of much debate and controversy. There is evidence to show the meetings were held on small dirt tracks in Australia and the United States before World War I. An American rider named Don Johns was known to have used broadsiding before 1914. It was said that he would ride the entire race course wide open, throwing great showers of dirt into the air at each turn. By the early 1920s, John's style of cornering was followed in the US a Euro, where the sport was initially called short track racing a Euro by riders such as Albert Shrimp Burns, Maldin Jones and Eddie Brink. Consequently, two long-held and common beliefs are incorrect. First, that New Zealand-born rider Johnny Hoskins invented the sport and second, that the first meeting was held on December 15, 1923 at West Maitland Showground, in the Hunter region of New South Wales, Australia. For instance, a contemporary newspaper report of this meeting, in the Maitland Mercury, mentions previous meetings. The first meeting in the United Kingdom took place at High Beach on February 19, 1928. There are, however, claims that meetings were held in 1927 at Camberley, Surrey and Royalston, Lancashire. Despite being described as the first British dirt track meeting at the time, the meeting at Camberley on May 7, 1927 differed in that the races were held in a clockwise direction. Races at Droylston were held in an anti-clockwise direction but it is generally accepted that the sport arrived in the United Kingdom when Australians Billy Galloway and Keith McKay arrived with the intention of introducing Speedway to the Northern Hemisphere. Both featured in the 1928 High Beach meeting. The first Speedway meeting in the UK to feature bikes with no brakes and broadsiding round corners on loose dirt was the third meeting held at High Beach on April 9, 1928 where Colin Watson, Alf Mudcalf and Digger Pugh demonstrated the art for the first time in the UK. Proto Speedway was staged in Glasgow at the Olympic Stadium on April 9, 1928 and the first fully professional meeting was staged at Celtic Park on April 28, 1928. The first meeting in Wales was staged at Cardiff White City on Boxing Day 1928. In the 1928-29 season at the Melbourne Exhibition Speedway, Australian Colin Stewart won the prestigious Silver Gauntlet, which required the rider to win the feature race ten times in one season. He won it twelve times. He also achieved success at an international level, racing for Southampton Saints in 1929 and captained Glasgow in the Northern League in 1930 before moving to Wembley Lions in 1931 for whom he rode in just four matches, averaging 4.00 points per match. He also raced in the 1930 Scottish Championship which was won by Wembley Lions Harry Whitfield. The forerunner of the World Championship, the Star Riders Championship, was inaugurated in Great Britain in 1929 but was split into two sections as it was felt that the British riders were not yet the equal of the Australians and Americans. Frank Arthur won the overseas section and Roger Frogley the British. The following year the two sections were amalgamated and Vic Huxley proved to be the winner. 
Huxley was also runner-up three times and won the first British Match Race Championship in 1931. Speedway racing typically took place on purpose-built tracks, although in Australia bikes shared larger speedways with cars such as sprint cars, speedcars and saloons, with tracks traditionally ranging from a mile showground tracks, such as the now-closed 520 metres Claremont Speedway in Perth and the 509 metres Sydney Showground, to smaller, purpose-built 300 metres long motorcycle tracks, such as Gilman Speedway in Adelaide and Mildura's Olympic Park. Speed. Each track is between 260 to 425 meters long and it takes approximately one minute to complete four laps. For example, 10-time Australian champion Lee Adams set a record time of 59 seconds on a 342 meters track and produced an average speed of 83 kilometers per hour. The speed on straight sections of the track reaches 110 kilometers per hour or more on longer tracks but the limited speed on curves lowers the average. At the start of a race it takes between 1 and 2 seconds for the motorcycle to reach the curve speed, which is roughly estimated to be the equivalent of 2.5 to 3 seconds to reach 100 km per hour. The start of the race is an important aspect of the race overall. Gating correctly can help a rider gain an initial advantage over other riders but speed advantages can be made as a race progresses. Those riders willing to take a risk and opt for finding the grippy parts of the track rather than the race line, are sometimes rewarded with extra speed allowing them to pass other riders either on the outside or the inside. Track Tracks used for professional speedway racing are regulated by the FAR Copyright DAO Copyright Ration International de Motocyclism who provide rules concerning construction, size and safety requirements. Speedway racing takes place on a level oval track consisting of two straights joined by two semi-circles. Tracks must be between 260 to 425 meters in length, this is measured at a distance of 1 meter from the inner boundary. Tracks may be banked, but the gradient must under no circumstances exceed 5% in the straight, 10% in the bends, and must remain constant and grow from the inner edge to the safety fence. A white start line is marked across the track approximately midway along one of the straights. The starting area is also divided into four equal parts by white lines marked at right angles to the start line and extending back at least one meter. Additional rules govern the placement of warning systems such as lights and also the construction of the starting mechanism. The minimum track width is 10 meters on the straights and the bends must be at least 14 meters wide. The minimum widths give each rider adequate space to safely navigate the track. The start line and starting gate assembly is halfway along one of the two straight sections of the track. Starting gates are simple spring-loaded mechanisms that raise two or three strands of tape to start the race. The FIM regulations require licensed tracks to provide a garage or pit area for motorcycles as well as medical and press facilities. Track boundaries are marked by white lines or barriers on the inside and outside of the track. Any rider who crosses this boundary with both wheels will be disqualified unless they only did so in the interest of safety or were forced to buy another competitor. The track surface consists of four layers of grading, the topmost of which must be of shale, granite, brick granules or other loose material of which no individual piece can be over 7 mm in size. Competitors use this surface to slide their machine sideways into the bends using the rear wheel to scrub off speed while still providing the drive to power the bike forward and around the bend. The skill of speedway lies in the overall ability of the rider to control his motorcycle when cornering and thus avoid losing places through deceleration. The use of asphalt, concrete and tarmac for any layer is prohibited. The top layer must be leveled or graded at intervals during an event by tractors towing specially adapted rakes to evenly redistribute the surface. Tracks are watered before and, if needed, during meetings to prevent the surface becoming too dry and to protect the public and the riders from dust. Safety requirements include the use of suspended wire fences, air fences and wooden fences. Air fences are made up of inflated panels installed on the bends. The fence is designed to dissipate energy by allowing an impacted area to compress and transfer air into the rest of the fence through blow-off valves or restriction ports connected to the other sections. They are mandatory for tracks in the British Elite League, Polish Extraliga, 
Speedway Grand Prix and Speedway World Cup. Neutral zones outside the track provide safe run-off areas for riders and their machinery to minimize the potential risk of injury to spectators. The majority of tracks are dedicated to speedway or other sports such as sidecar speedway and banger racing. For larger events, the FIM occasionally sanctions the use of stadiums that install temporary tracks such as the British Grand Prix held at the Millennium Stadium in Cardiff. Motorcycles Speedway uses a unique type of motorcycle, governed by the FIM's track racing technical rules. In the past, bikes with upright engines were used, but today most professional riders use lay-down bikes as it is argued that they are easier to handle. As speedway bikes do not use brakes, the clutch is used as a release mechanism at the start of races. FIM regulations state that the motorcycles must have no brakes, are powered by pure methanol, use only one gear and weigh a minimum of 77 kilograms. By using engine and rear wheel sprockets the gear ratio can be adjusted as required for track conditions. The use of methanol allows for an increased compression ratio to the engine producing more power than other fuels and resulting in higher speeds when cornering. Machines used must, weigh no less than 77 kg, use a four-stroke, single-cylinder engine with one carburetor and one spark plug and a maximum capacity of 500 cc, have guards fitted over moving engine parts where reasonable, Use an additional chain guard to prevent a hand or fingers being cut at the nip point where the chain meets the sprocket by a chain, have a peg fitted to prevent a broken primary chain flailing and injuring a rider or a fellow competitor, use shatter-resistant plastics where reasonable, be fitted with a dirt deflector, be fueled by methanol with no additives, be fitted with an approved silencer, have a handle by width greater than 650 mm and less than 850 mm, Machines used cannot be constructed in any part from titanium, use uncoated ceramic parts, use telemetry during a race except for timing purposes, use any electronic components to control the engine, use brakes of any form, use supercharger or a turbocharger of any kind. In addition all motorcycles must have a safety cutout device fitted, this is defined as a switch that must cut off the circuit of the electrical supply by the simple action of pulling a lanyard or a non-elastic string, attached to the rider's right wrist. The high compression ratio of the engine can also assist in slowing down a machine. If the throttle is closed the engine may stop. Riders can stop the bike by deliberately laying down the bike on the track and this technique is used to avoid riders who fall in front of a pursuing colleague. Before cutouts were fitted an engine was stopped in an emergency situation by removing the plug lead from the spark plug or shutting off the fuel supply. Racing Races consist of four riders racing over four laps from a standing start. Riders wear different colored helmets, traditionally in team events red and blue denote home team riders, and white and yellow black quartered colors denote visiting riders. The starting area is divided into a grid of four equal parts and the riders from each team must take their place in alternate grids or gates. The colors also denote starting positions and individual events. Red is the inside gate, blue starts from gate 2, white starts from gate 3 and yellow black starts on the outside. Riders must be able to get their bikes to the start line under their own power, without any external assistance and not by pushing the machine, then line up in parallel. A rider who is not at the start line within a reasonable period of time is also liable to be disqualified, although league matches in the UK allow teams to elect to start the disqualified rider 15 metres back from the tapes or replace the disqualified rider with a team reserve. This period of time is standardised to two minutes from a time determined by the match referee and usually indicated by a bell, a rotating orange lamp or a digital clock readout. All riders must be at the tapes under their own power before the two minutes have elapsed. Additional time between races will be allowed by, and at the discretion of, the referee if a rider has two consecutive rides, to allow the rider time to prepare. A starting gate consisting of two or more tapes is erected across the start line. The riders must situate themselves not more than 10 centimeters from this and not touch it once the green light comes on. They must also remain stationary until the tapes are raised. Failure to do so is known as a tape infringement and can result in a false start being recorded and the rider penalized. 
The race is started with the raising of the start tape mechanism operated by the match referee and the riders must proceed around the track in an anti-clockwise direction without both wheels illegally leaving the track boundaries. Once the race is underway, no rider can receive outside assistance, including push starts, from others. Historically, pushes were allowed at the start of the race. A white line at the 30-meter mark used to designate the extent to which a push was allowed but due to safety concerns, assistance is now illegal. Occasionally races consist of six riders but this is rare as most tracks are too narrow to accommodate the extra riders safely. Scoring Speedway operates a sliding scale for scoring. Three points are scored for first place, two points for second place and one point for third place. A rider does not score when finishing fourth, or failing to finish, or if excluded from a race. These points accumulate over the competition, with riders' points either counting towards individual or team placings. In the event of a tie, the race is commonly awarded as a dead heat. If it is a tie for first place, they will both receive two points. A tie for second place earns each rider one point while a joint last finish earns each rider zero points. Teams can use a tactical substitute rule once in a meeting. If that team is eight or more points in arrears, they may bring in the use of a different rider in their team lineup, to race in any heat except for heat 15. This may be different in World Cup or event racing. If they are ten or more points behind, a rider with a scheduled ride may go out for double points, in which the rider's points will be doubled if he beats a rider of the opposing team. Any rider taking a tactical substitute ride or double points ride is denoted by a black and white helmet color as rather than one of the four usual colored helmets. If that rider remains unbeaten by either opposition rider his scored points are doubled and also count towards the rider's calculated match average. Calculated match averages, the sport produces calculated match averages for every rider, these are calculated from the following. CMA scale from 3.00 to 12.00, any rider scoring above or below this range of values will be awarded the maximum or minimum respectively. These averages are used in leagues such as the Elite League in the UK to identify heat leaders for the purposes of choosing which riders to enter for each race. At the start of a season, a rider retains their last recorded CMA until they have competed in six home and six away matches. A new CMA is then issued that comes into effect seven days later. These are subsequently updated on the 15th of every month from May onwards, and come into effect on the 1st of the next month. These CMAs are used in most professional leagues and are altered or weighted depending on the league the rider gained the CMA in. A rider that has no recorded average will receive an indicative CMA for the start of the season that is assessed on their prior experience in the sport. Competitions equals international equals an international individual speedway championship has taken various forms since its beginnings in the 1930s with the official world championship first held in 1936 the present FIM Speedway Grand Prix championship organized by Speedway Grand Prix has taken place since 1995 the SGP uses a scoring system based on each rider's overall final position the rider who has gained the most points at the end of the tournament is declared the world champion. American rider Greg Hancock is the current world champion. The annual British Grand Prix is currently held at the Millennium Stadium in Cardiff, Wales. Scoring in Grand Prix events changed in 2005 with riders scoring 3-2-1-0 in their races and these points being carried forward to decide the winner of each Grand Prix. At the end of the series the highest scorer becomes the world champion. World Speedway champions include Ivan Major, fellow New Zealander Barry Briggs, Ole Olsen, Ove Fundin, Lionel Van Prague, Hans Nielsen, Tony Rickardson, Eric Gunderson and Jason Crump, both three times world champions, and the sport's first two-time champion Jack Young who won in 1951 and 1952. The Speedway World Cup is also held each year featuring teams from the major speedway countries, usually in a series of meetings over the space of a week in the summer. In 2001 the World Cup replaced the old Speedway World Team Cup which had first run in 1960. The current World Cup champions are Denmark. 
The Speedway World Pairs Championship was an annual Speedway event held each year in different countries. Competing countries picked their top two riders to represent them. The first competition was held in 1970 and the final competition was held in 1993. From 1994 the World Pairs was merged with a World Team Cup. Domestic Competitions Most European countries run their own domestic speedway leagues. The FIM affiliated governing bodies in each country operate league systems, normally comprising several divisions, in which the teams gain points throughout the season depending on results. Teams are placed into tables, placing them in order according to points accrued. Most commonly, each team races every other team in its league at home and away in each season, in a round-robin tournament. Meetings traditionally consist of two teams riding against each other with four riders in each race with two home team riders and two away team riders. Meetings usually feature 15 heats and each rider is scheduled to ride four or five times. The team with the most points at the end of the meeting is the winner. Most league seasons end with playoffs, a series of meetings between the highest finishing teams to determine a league champion. The champions may be promoted to a higher division and the team finishing at the bottom are in some countries relegated to a lower division. The majority of countries supplement the league system with one or more cup competitions. These are organized on a knockout basis, the winner of each match proceeding to the next round and the loser taking no further part in the competition. The major speedway nations in Europe are the United Kingdom, Sweden, Poland and Denmark. These countries run a number of leagues and have regular fixtures throughout the traditional speedway season that runs from March to October. On a smaller scale, competitions are also held in Argentina, Australia, Czech Republic, Italy, Russia, Slovenia and the United States. Some countries' top divisions feature highly paid star riders. In smaller countries and lower divisions, riders may be part-timers with a second job, or amateurs. Equals United Kingdom equals. The United Kingdom has three main domestic leagues, the Elite League, the Premier League, and the National League, as well as two junior amateur leagues. It also has a youth championship. Equals Poland equals. Speedway is one of the most popular sports in Poland and is governed by the main commission for speedway sport which is a part of the Polish motor union Polski Zezek Motorali. The PZM is a member of the FIM and the Union Europa Copyright Ender Motocyclism. The Polish Extra League has the highest average attendances for any sport in Poland. The first speedway meetings in Poland were held in the 1930s and league racing began in 1948. There are three championships in Poland, individual, pairs and team. The Junior Under-21 Championships also has three competitions, individual pairs and team. There are three leagues, Extra League, First League and Second League. In the 2007 season, the Extra League and First League had eight teams competing and the Second League had seven teams. The GKSA organizes the Golden Helmet, Silver Helmet and Bronze Helmet competitions. Individual meetings such as the Criterium of Polish Speedway League Aces, Miecz Zysilai Pukut Memorial, Alfred Smokuk Memorial and Edward Janouts Memorial are also popular. The Polish national team are current Speedway World Cup champions, and have also won the competition in 2005, 2007, and 2009. Poland has produced two individual world champions, Jerzy Skzakiel in 1973 and Tomasz Golub in 2010. The Polish junior team won the Under-21 World Championship in 2005 and 2006 and since 2003 four Polish juniors have won the Under-21 Individual World Championship. In total, seven Polish riders have been world champions at Under-21 level. Equal Sweden equals. Speedway in Sweden is governed by the Swedish Motorcycle and Snowmobile Federation. The first Swedish Speedway League was founded in 1948 and copied the British format of league racing, including adopting the Swedish version of several British teams' nicknames. The Elite League was established in 1982 and has ten teams. At the end of each season the top four teams ride in the playoffs in semi-finals and a final and the winner of the final are the Elite 3N champions. 
the team finishing bottom of the league are relegated to the National League. The Alsvenskan has seven teams and before the introduction of the Elitserien in 1982 was the top flight speedway league in Sweden. As with the Alsvenskan, the top four teams at the end of each season ride in the playoffs in semi-finals and a final. The Alsvenskan Division 1 is the third tier of Swedish speedway with seven teams. The team finishing the season in first place are champions and can apply for promotion to the Alsvenskan, subject to having suitable facilities and sufficient finances. Other competitions include the Swedish Individual Championship and the Swedish Junior Individual Championship. The Swedish Individual Championship is contested by 18 riders in a Grand Prix format with 20 heats. The individual champion in 2008 was Magnus Zetterström. The junior individual championship is for riders aged 21 years and under. Equals Denmark equals, Speedway in Denmark is administrated by Denmark's Motor Union. The sport was introduced into Denmark in the 1930s but it didn't boom until the 1970s. Notable Danish Speedway riders today include, Nicky Pedersen, John Pedersen and Hans Nard Gaard Andersen. Former rider L.A. Olsen won the World Championship three times and his success helped popularize the sport in Denmark. Since retiring Olsen has become an FIM Speedway Grand Prix race director. A popular Danish rider in the 1960s was Arne Panda, and in the 1980s Erik Gundersen, Jan O. Pedersen and Hans Nielsen. League competitions There are three leagues in Denmark, Danish League, Division 1, Division 2. Speedway meetings are held between April and September. The Danish league has six teams with meetings traditionally held on Wednesday evenings. At the end of each season the top four teams compete in the playoffs in semi-finals and a final. The winner of the final are the league champions. There is no promotion or relegation and membership of the Danish league is by application only. At the end of each season the top five teams in the Danish league compete in the Danish Super Cup an end-of-season competition, held as a single event. It is hosted by the winning team from the previous season. Both Division 1 and Division 2 are the second and third tier and are mostly for amateur riders. Meetings are held on Saturdays with a mid-summer break. Division 1 can have a maximum of eight teams, with the remaining teams riding in Division 2. Meetings are staged using a four-team format. In principle, the team finishing bottom of Division 1 is relegated and replaced by the top team in Division 2 as long as their parent club does not already have a team in Division 1. However, this does not always happen for financial reasons. There is also no promotion and relegation if the bottom team in Division 1 and the top team in Division 2 are operated by same club. Other competitions the Individual Speedway Danish Championship is a competition for riders holding a Danish passport and a valid DMU license. Riders must submit their entries at least four weeks before the first meeting of the competition. Any riders who competed in the Speedway Grand Prix or World Championship qualifying rounds during the previous season are seeded directly to the final. The DMU may also seed other riders directly to the final at their discretion. Either one or two semi-finals are staged depending on the number of riders entering the competition. Riders are selected for these rounds according to the previous season's Danish averages. If one semi-final is held, the highest placed riders qualify for the final. If two semi-finals are held, the highest placed riders from each meeting qualify for the final. The winner of the final is awarded a gold medal and declared Danish individual champion. The riders finishing second and third are awarded silver and bronze medals respectively. The final classification also determines which riders qualify for the World Individual Speedway Championship. The Danish Under-21 Individual Speedway Championship is a competition for riders holding a Danish passport, a valid DMU license, and who are under 21 years of age on January 1 in the year of the competition. Riders wishing to compete must submit their entries at least four weeks before the first meeting of the competition. If there are 72 or more entries, four quarterfinals are staged. If there are between 54 and 71 entries, three quarterfinals are staged. If there are fewer than 54 entries, two semi-finals are held. 
Riders are selected for these rounds according to the previous season's averages in Danish matches only. When four quarter-finals are staged, the top eight riders in each progress to the semi-finals. When three quarter-finals are staged, the top ten riders from one round, and the top eleven riders from each of the other rounds, progress to the semi-finals. The top eight riders from each semi-final meet in the final. The winner of the final is awarded a gold medal and declared Danish junior individual champion. Riders finishing second and third are awarded silver and bronze medals respectively. The top five finishes qualify for the World Junior Speedway Championship. There is a great depth of league speedway for all ages in Denmark. The youth leagues are for riders between 8 and 18 years of age and 80 cc's bikes are used. The micro leagues are for riders between 3 and 10 years of age and 50 cc's bikes are used. And the old boys league is for riders over 33 years of age. National Team Denmark enter a team in the Speedway World Cup. They won the competition in 2006, 2008 and 2012. Previously they won the Speedway World Team Cup in 1978, 1981, 1983, 1984. 1985, 1986, 1987, 1988, 1991, 1995 and 1997. Denmark also won the Speedway World Pairs Championship in 1979, 1985, 1986, 1987, 1988, 1989, 1990 and 1991. Danish Grand Prix the Danish Speedway Grand Prix is held in the Park and Stadium in Copenhagen. Equals Australia equals, although there was a short-lived interstate competition in Australia during the 1970s, due to the large size of the country riders have traditionally raced mostly at their local tracks, though the top riders often race away from home for championship or other high-profile meetings. The Australian Individual Speedway Championship is the oldest continuously running national speedway championship in the world having been run since 1926 with the exception of 1942 a year 1945 when racing was suspended during World War II, and 1955 a year 1961 when the championship was not held. The first championship was held at the Newcastle Showgrounds in Newcastle, New South Wales and was won by was won by American rider Sec Brown. For a number of years qualification for the Australian final came from the various state championships held around the country. The Australian final was held in various Australian states, usually on a rotating basis. The top places in the final would then progress to the next stage of the World Championship qualifying. At times the next stage varied from the short-lived Australasian final which included riders from New Zealand, the overseas final which saw Commonwealth riders race with the Americans, or the Commonwealth final which was restricted to riders from Commonwealth nations. The Australian solo final was run in the traditional single meeting format from 1926 to 2002. Since 2003 the Australian Championship has been run over a series of rounds. Australia also runs annual national championship meetings for under-16s and under-21s. These meetings are run in the traditional single meeting format and like the senior championship was for a number of years, the finals are held in various Australian states on a rotating basis. National Team Australia enter a team in both the Speedway World Cup and the Under-21 World Cup. They won the World Cup in 2001 and 2002. Previously they won the Speedway World Team Cup in 1976 and 1999. The Under-21 team placed second in the 2012 Under-2 World Cup. For the first time, the Under-21 World Cup final will be held outside of Europe in 2015 with the final scheduled to be held at the Olympic Park Speedway in Mildura on October 31. Australia Grand Prix the Speedway Grand Prix of Australia will be held in the Docklands Stadium in Melbourne from 2015. Previously the SGP of Australia was held in 2002 at Stadium Australia. Equals Bulgaria equals, Bulgaria has one domestic league, with a total of six Speedway tracks. In 2011, after years of neglect, the national championship was restored, conducted in cooperation with Romania. In 1977 the track in Targuvisht, in the country's northeast, 
was licensed for international meetings. The track then held the quarter-final of the European Youth Championship in 1978, won by Nikolai Manev. The eighth finals were held there in 1982, 1985, 1986 and 1987, with a semi-final in 1980 and the 1982 semi-final for the World Pairs Championship, followed by the 1988 quarter-finals for the European Youth Championship. Among the most prominent Bulgarian riders are, Angel Vtimov, Nikolai Manev, Olin Yanakiev, Vizelin Markov, Stravo Yordin, Mil Manev. Equals other nations equals. Introduced to Italy by occupying soldiers after World War II, Speedway is most popular around the northeast of the country. The regions of Friuli Venezia Giulia, Trentino Alto Adige Tsar, one quarter DTIROL, Lombardy and Veneto host race meetings with the latter also hosting the Speedway Grand Prix of Italy in the town of Lonigo. The most successful Speedway rider from Italy was Armando Castafna. Castafna was the only Italian professional Speedway rider in the history of the sport, and qualified five times for an individual world final. Another former rider, Giuseppe Marzotta makes the GM Speedway engines. Speedway in Germany is overshadowed by its more popular track racing variant Sandbahn. However, the country has occasionally hosted the Speedway Grand Prix of Germany and has produced one Speedway world champion, Egon Maher won quarter Lair in 1983. Another German rider is Martin Smolinski, who won the New Zealand Grand Prix in Auckland in March 2014. See also, auto race, dirt track racing, grass track, ice speedway, outline of motorcycles and motorcycling, track racing. Further reading, Jackson, Jeremy. St. Austell Speedway, the early years 1949-1954. NPI Media Group. ISBN 0-7524-3789-5. Jackson, Jeremy. St. Austell Speedway 1958-1963 plus the sidecar years. J&S Publications. ISBN 0-9526419-7-6. References. External links. Speedway at DMOZ, 1, FIM Speedway Grand Prix, Motorcycle Speed Demons, September 1934, Popular Science Early Article on the Motorcycle Sport with Rare Photos.